Good morning, guys. So it is 8.30, and we're going to head down and get some breakfast, and then get on the road as soon as we can. So that's the plan, and I was really excited because they have all the little soaps and stuff that are in the um, San Francisco soap company. Um, but anyway, the, the scent is sugared citrus, which is my favorite. I get so excited when they have that one. So, anyway, yes. Oh, thank you. Right here. That's what they look like. I wish I could smell them for you. They smell really good. Um, so, and I was also excited because everything um, got posted and saved and I did have to, like, get up a few times in the night to, like, see if it was done and make sure it didn't put up an absolutely heinous picture <laughs> as the cover. Um, but everything got charged up and, and everything uploaded and so we're happy and we're gonna go get some breakfast and quit the day and so off we go. Nathan made us a very beautiful waffle. Here's just a real quick run around of our room. Because <laughs> I didn't do that last night. It's just standard, but yeah. So we're loading up and going to head out. And it is 9.04, so a little later than we had anticipated, but I think we're still doing okay. So, oh, <sighs> I didn't show you guys, but we went down and looked at the pool uh, real quick before we left because they had these really cool, like, um, like wooden painted, um, kind of carved s signs for it um, that looked kind of tropical, and they called it like the safari game room and pool or something. And we went in there, and in the game room they've got like tiki torches all like around the lights and like um, kind of like rainforest foliage kind of, and then you walk further into the pool and there's a balcony and you're looking down and they have a whole room painted like a rainforest and then all the like pool chairs have like cushions on it that coordinate with the jungle theme and it was really cute looking it would have been nice to make it down there but we were so tired we literally like <laughs> fell asleep right away so um but anyway here's kind of what it looks like from the outside in case you're ever on your way down to um, Indiana and you want to stay at a, a hotel with a jungle pool. <laughs> so, um, and I forget the name of the town right now. I think it started with an A, um, like Angola or Angola or something. So, and now he's coming back and we're gonna head out. I wanted to give you guys a real quick look at what we're driving in today. Uh, we just left a few minutes ago, it's 9.30, it's 23 degrees, and the roads are bare, so we found the bare roads there in Indiana. We have sunshine, and rain. We have sunshine. Yeah, we got some kind of a traffic jam, it looks like, but we got blue skies and bare grounds. Using fundamentally alien technology. And it's 29 degrees, and it is. Give all the logistics During her here. initial investigations, oh, 11:27, and I'm in sleeping. So <laughs> I don't really know anything. I just woke up. Beef cows. Beef cows for your viewing pleasure. We have a taste of Ohio, and it's. I'll tell you that sunshine feels fantastic. <laughs> Nate's wishing we had brought our sunglasses. Um, so, but it's nice. We can't complain. And the snow is gone. And we got out. We stopped at a um, shell because gas had gone up to 345, I think. Um, and it was thrill still 345. Three, that's what I said. Oh, sorry. I said 345. I'm sorry. It went up our living. We paid 316 at the shell because it had not gone up yet. So, um, and then one of the guys at the gas station, or at Subway where we stopped to use the bathroom, had mentioned that, um, exit 94.
before is where this traffic jam kind of ends because they're painting the roads, I guess. Um, so that's the cause of it. It's kind of nice to know the cause. I guess at least know kind of what's going on. Um, and that it's not an accident or anything. So this is still the traffic jam. They moved us all over to the left lane. So we're still stuck in it, but um, we just got off the phone with Nate's dad too and he mentioned that a lot of people are going down to Florida. So that could be part of this. Um, but hopefully we're almost through it. And he did give us an alternate route to think about, which we, we might take, um, which is I think more back roads, but it's more of a, more convenient, so. That's lots of fields and lots of sun and blue skies and and not the most exciting, but we're out of the snow. So and I took my boots off because at that last um, stop I felt really silly. Like I didn't even put my coat on. Everybody was just like in hoodies and the wind was a little chilly. It's it's 30, but um, I felt really silly in my winter boots, so I took those off. <laughs> we are busting out Kit Kats and the trail mix. Christmas it's that time. Oh, they're cute. These are from my parents. Mm -hmm. They're so cute. They're like half attached and then half at Santa. <laughs> and um, look, we're moving a little bit faster. No. no? I just left a gap. <laughs> oh. Okay, well, wishful thinking. Wishy. I know it. Wow. So this is the reason for the backup. All these trucks are repaving and painting the roads what and they've got all these, these little lights on them. These trucks are waiting to fill up with asphalt from the old road to remove it. Oh, <laughs> but there's so many of them. Yep. Huge line. I bet they're spaced out. Each one is full by the time it gets to the other one. Huh. And then it dumps off the load and catches up and cycles through again. The things you learn on the highway. <laughs> I like those chevron stripes on the back. We were discussing the chevron stripes. Very stylish. <laughs> Look at this beautiful cityscape. I don't know what that city is, but... <laughs> Cincinnati? No. Or is it Daytona? Oh, Daytona. It's big. Left. And I would just like to point out that it's 38 degrees, which is really happy. That which I was told to do. That's good. Let's play 20 questions. Question one. Have you ever... I have to pick something first. Oh, what? You pick a question? No, no, no. 20 questions is I pick something and you try and figure out. You have 20 questions to figure it out. Oh, okay. You don't just ask 20 <laughs> random questions. <laughs> okay, fine. We can play that too. <laughs> I don't think it sounds as much fun. <laughs> okay, think of something. <laughs> is it green? I haven't thought of something okay. yet. I gotta think of something. Hold okay. On. Um. All right, I got something. Okay. <laughs> Good. Wait, not you. <laughs> Is it green? No. Is it blue? No. Red? No. Purple? No. White? Are you keeping track of these? Because you only have 20 of them. Oh, oops. I thought, okay. Oh, uh, I need a new strategy. <laughs> <laughs> Is it alive? Why would I keep track of 20 questions? It doesn't help me out at all. Aren't you supposed to keep track of my 20 questions? No, I'm driving. I know, I can You keep it. track of 20 questions and the questions. I'm driving. Are you videotaping all this? Yes. This is not going to be good footage. <laughs> <laughs> Look what we are getting into. A little bit of mountains or foothills. Foothills. Oh, foothills of West Virginia. And they're beautiful. I have always been an ocean girl. I like the sunsets and the sunrises and the surfing and all of that, but I have a growing appreciation for mountains too because they're so majestic. They're very pretty. Oh, I just turned on my camera to get the mountains and they're gone. <laughs> oh, but there's a bridge, look. Beautiful. It's a beautiful mountain bridge. Oh. <laughs> look at these cute little cars that passed us. Cute little like Pikachu cars. <laughs> Aww. Best They're cute. Friends. They're best friends. Driving down the highway. Yeah. Here's some more foothills. They're very pretty. I'm 
very excited about them. <laughs> As you can tell. Every time I see one, I'm like, a oh, foothill, and then it disappears. Like, we and don't have we hills in Michigan. I know, but these are big hills. Just bigger just hills. Just bigger hills. They don't have snow on them. Oh. It was really cool because we were driving, and it looked like um, we were going back into through the seasons, like backwards. Like, we went into, like, it looked like fall, and then it looked more summery, and now we're seeing a little bit more green and a little bit more kind of summery-ish. And that sunshine is really nice. <laughs> Gonna say, I don't think you're getting over any of that on your side of the car. Whoa, well, I'm way zoomed in. And it's 42 degrees. So. 42 degrees. It's yeah. still going up, even though the sun is going down. Yeah. So, and our estimated time of arrival right now is 2:54 in the morning. So it's we'll see. Down. We'll see. Until yes, we it is going down. Yes. Until we stop yeah. We'll be quick. Oh, look at these. Look how green that grass is. Wow. All these foothills. I'm so excited about this foothills. I can't wait to wear it. We are into the foothills now. These are foothills. But, I mean, you can't tell, but we're going up. And uh, we're not going to get on an adventure. But that's to be expected. So, foothills. What if he had witnessed? Fries. I got a McDouble as well. Oh, and we both got McDouble. Yes. I usually get a McChicken, but I deviated. <laughs> Guess whose turn it is to drive? You to focus on that. This is just a little west of blurry West Virginia. It's not nearly as flat as this video makes it look like. <laughs> so, big hills, lot of farmland. Deer. There's a lot of deer right off the road, but they don't even care. Except for that dead one right in the front yard. So, cows. Farms right on the edge of the road. Look at this house, that's pretty. Random, really pretty houses. <laughs> oh, blinding sunshine. Alright, I got done with my shift. I drove through Charleston, Charleston, West Virginia, or South Carolina? West Virginia. Yes, it's a very pretty town. I want to like research it because it's so cool. It like, I went over like three or four bridges, which make me very nervous, by the way. Um, especially the really narrow one that was during construction. That was, that was a little difficult. But um, the whole city like winds around this river, and it's really, it's really pretty and really cool. And got this route. big factory over here. If you can see beyond the like the regular, you know, gas station and stuff, <coughs> it has. It's all lit up behind it, right on the edge of the river. Turn left. Turn left. Which is really pretty. So, it looks like it's a DuPont factory, which is a DuPont. Is that paint? Yeah. 
Oh, uh, it's chemical. Oh, chemical? Yep. So, there's a star up on the hill there. And, oh my goodness, yeah. If I need to update my town count, my um, GPS, and so we were using his phone, so we've got two people yelling at us instead of just one. <laughs> but, yeah, I could do that. But um, our estimated time of arrival on this on Siri and the phone is uh, Turn left, merge on to I 12 39 a.m., which is better than three in the morning. So, um, and it's really pretty. We've been in the mountains for quite a while, so it's very mountainous. I know. Well, I enjoy it. Try to enjoy it. You did. I'm just saying you can enjoy it. Yes, without worrying about rolling the car. <laughs> just kidding. There is the factory over there. It never almost happened. It's the prettiest factory I think I've ever seen. It's pretty. Look at all the lights on it. So. lights. Coffee break. I, oh, I'm you, ringing. You I'm ringing. We stopped to get coffee. And now I'm getting a phone call. Anyway, we stopped to grab coffee and we've got about five hours to go. So. Sounds like a stop. It does. It wasn't me. <laughs> okay, so not to be like all or anything but this guy's got a cat in the back of his car so I think we've been in the car for like 15 hours or something wait okay hold on no it couldn't be that long because we started at 9 30 9 30 to 5 30 <laughs> like eight hours okay eight hours in the car that's a long time and I'm ready to like stretch my legs and run laps and go crazy <laughs> So we did grab a, um, a hotel coupon thing in case we end up staying here. It's uh, right now we're supposed to get there around 12:27, and we're hoping we can get that down to midnight or before, which doesn't seem like that bad. But when you think of five more hours, and it already seems like later than it is because it's so dark. I don't know if we'll end up staying at one more place before we get there. So I don't know. We'll see. Well, it looks like we've come across another obstacle. <laughs> another traffic jam. And we're not sure what is the cause of this one because it's too dark to paint anything. Oh, so hopefully it's not a crash, but uh, <laughs> we might not. Hopefully this isn't, isn't going to put us back too far. Here's our sign. Welcome to North Carolina. Exciting, and that traffic jam actually wasn't that bad, and it looked like someone had gone off the road, but they were okay, so no worries. <laughs> I only <laughs> you will be asleep. You won't know you're not supposed to. Oh my goodness! Look, it's a beautiful city. Dun da 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 dun. Isn't night driving fun? Ooh, my phone is ringing. Getting a phone call. That phone's gonna need to be charged. Christmas tree. It's just hanging. No man ever. Hey guys, we finally made it after I think um, 21 hours in the car. Um, but we made it safe and we found our group the house okay. Um, yeah, so good to see everyone. I'm glad to be here. Um, 
whispering. 